My name is Dr. Jane Griffin, Principal Research Scientist at Hauptman Woodward Medical Research Institute, formerly known as the Medical Foundation of Buffalo, and I've been associated with this institution for over 35 years. Hauptman Woodward is known more nationally and internationally than it is locally. Hauptman Woodward is a basic medical research institute using the techniques of x-ray crystallography to look at the atomic level three-dimensional structures of proteins. Knowing the three-dimensional shape is used today to design drugs that fit these molecules precisely. This year, uh, Dr. Deb Ghosh uh, achieved a breakthrough in doing the structure of estrogen aromatase, uh, which we have been studying in the laboratory for over 30 years. Being able to inhibit the production of estrogen is a very important uh, part of a strategy for controlling breast cancer. We're in our 36th year of a summer intern program for college students, and uh, Dr. William Duax has a program where he has high school students working directly with him doing his research. Campus is really coming into fruition. The Hauptman Woodward Institute, the Center of Excellence, and the Roswell Park Genetics and Pharmacology, they were all built within a period of, of two years. There was no lag time, and I think it's a great success. The next period for the Buffalo Niagara Medical Campus is going to focus more on the clinical side, and the cardiovascular center at Kaleida will start to be built. The shovel will be in the ground. There will be a new nursing home facility on Michigan Avenue near Buffalo General. UB is expanding in their UB 2020 program. They've taken over the M. Weil building and they will be putting their first people into it, I believe, this summer. Things are moving along. In addition, one of the successes of the uh, BNMC is that from the beginning, we worked with the adjoining neighborhoods. There is much new housing going up. I think it would be interesting for anyone to drive around the Fruit Belt and see how much uh, is going on there. It really uh, looks like it's a neighborhood that is returning. I am a native of Buffalo. I have lived my entire life in Buffalo. I've done all my schooling in Buffalo, including a PhD at uh, UB in the chemistry department. And yet, I feel very privileged that I can work at an institute where the president is a Nobel laureate, where the science that is being done is absolutely first rate, and I didn't have to move to work here. So what we like to tell the students is that they can come back and work at a state-of-the-art institution and don't have to leave the Western New York area.